Greetings guys, Sign Joe here. Today, today we're here to interview two new structure packs. And we're talking about Joey Wheeler's Fields of the Warriors and Yugi's uh, didn't get to read it before I clicked to Joey's. Now, so let's go ahead and uh, interview this. We have a Gilfert the Legend, which is obviously the boss of this pack. Cannot be special summon. When this card is on normal summon on the field, you can equip equip spells from your graveyard as are as many equip spells from your graveyard as possible. So it's a it's a good card if like you're you really pumped up a monster. It's like at twenty eight let's say twenty eight hundred uh, attack because you pumped it up with a lucky axe and um, I don't know a. Uh, 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 Axe of I forgot the guardian's name. Whatever. Anyway, so yeah, be good. Really good if you you have some equip spells. We have battle guard king, which personally I'm not. I might not be using though. That that, that attack looks a little beefy, so I might change my mind on that. Whatever. Um, once per turn, you contribute any number of monsters, and this card can attack as many times for each monster. So maybe I'm being a fool with not attacking. I'll probably use it. Maybe I'll use it over this guy. I don't know. And then we have Commander Go Gotham Swordsmaster. I'm going to use this because uh, for the pack, it's pretty good. We have X Saber. And then again, like I said, for the pack, it's pretty good because all face up Saber monsters you control gain 400. So this would be it for the. You yeah, add 400. And then, yeah. So uh, if this card attacks opponent's monster, this card gains 600 attack during the sta damage step only. Already making out to be a pretty great card. If this card is attacked by an opponent's monster, this card loses 500 attack during, yeah, see, that's what makes it pretty bad. It's it's good and bad, so yeah. We have DD Warrior, which is extremely good, because if, if your opponent's using, like, a, a, a Blue Eyes or something, any even if it's in defense, you can just attack it. in For the small price of some damage, you can get rid of it. And then we have Marmadin Captain. When this card is normal, so you, you can shuffle one card from your deck into, or from your hand into your deck, and then draw one card. Then you can special summon if it is a monster. So this is a very good card. Uh, if you summon this, you're most, you might get something really good, or you could get something bad. It's all, it's all, you know what you think it might be. And I like the art. It's funny. You, you got this really tough guy, and uh, he, he's making soup with an apron and then then you got some other cards you can recognize like that's the king in the background over there and the other one was the the knight that i use so yeah that's a pretty good card. and then this is possibly my favorite for um <clears throat> scientific reasons a female x saber warrior known for her graceful attacks and calm decision making in battle her ambition is merciless and her strikes in, uh, and strikes fear into the heart of her enemies i can't read so yeah that's my favorite card of the uh, set for scientific reasons. Uh, now we're moving on to spell and trap cards. Equip only to an X Saber monster if it destroys a monster by battle. You can destroy one opponent card your opponent controls. You can tribute one monster you, you control for, to return this card from your graveyard to the top of your deck. This is a really good card. Um, you can get it back into your deck really easily. It's a field spell, so you know it's really great. So yeah, or maybe it's not a field spell. It's a my bad. It's not a field spell. It's an equip spell because it got a little plus thingy. I can't read or see. And this is uh, that was called Sword of Sparkles. This is called Assault, Assault Armor. You see, you got Neos in there. Equip only to a warrior type monster that uh, is the only monster you control gains Stranger attack during the main phase. You can send this equipped monster to the graveyard to allow this equipped monster. See, the thing is, it has to be the only card. Your monster has to be the only monster on the field, and I feel like that's very circumstantial. So, it's not what I think it'd be as good as. So, Then you have or Armed Changer. Um, send one equipped soul from your hand to the graveyard to activate this card. It's this equipped soul destroys a monster. Or if the equipped monster destroys a monster by battle, the controller of this card... Equip card can add one monster with equal. See again, that's very circumstantial. That's assuming your opponent has the same cards as you. So, yeah, that's very circumstantial. So I probably won't use that. This I'll use the A forces. All warrior type monsters you gain uh, control gain 200 attack for each warrior or spell type monster you control. I'll definitely be using that. Then we have Soul of Dragon Sword. This 
this uh, this card can only be equipped to a warrior type monster. So if you have this, you better have a only warrior type deck, which is why I'm using Joey. A monster equipped with this card increases its attack by 700. A dragon type monster that battles with the equipped monster is destroyed at the end of the battle phase. Damage calculation. So you could just suicide attack, and even if you lose, you could still have, uh, let's say, a blue eyes die or blue eyes ultimate dragon, or even that uh that insanely strong five-headed dragon so yeah you really have some options uh, and then po draw of avarus target five card you know what draw of avarus do does you you've seen it so and that's that's oh wait there's one more staunch defender you can only activate this card when your opponent declares an attack select one face of monster on your side of the field during this turn your opponent can only uh designate the selected monster as an attack target and your opponent must Attack the selected monster with all face up monsters. Now you see the thing is that's a very good card. I might use it, I might not. I can't. It's a really good card to um, ward off your opponent, buy you some time, you know. So that's good. And that was Joey's uh, Fields of the Warriors. It's a legendary warrior pack. And we have Hero Rising Yuma where the hero dwells. Now, let's see. Or no, wait, that's what it comes with. Durr. Special Ed Kid. <clears throat> now these cards aren't as powerful as Joey's, but they're still pretty good. This card I have it in real life. It basically, if you summon it, you can add one polymerization to the deck. Also, you can activate this effect. You can special summon a monster from this turn. It has to be a hero monster, blah blah blah, and to be here except for elemental hero blazeman. Uh, and if you do this card's attribute attack, yeah, so it's really good. If you have elemental heroes, that's really good. Polymerization, which I, I like the art on that polymerization, looks really cool. So I might just swap out a polymerization just to see that. Actually, with that, hmm, that would take up space, wouldn't it? Would it not? Would it not? <laughs> All right, so let's continue. Uh, elemental hero, f uh, flash. When this card is destroyed by battle. And sent to the graveyard, you can banish this card and three elemental hero monsters uh, cards with different names from the graveyard. Target one spell card in your graveyard at the target to your end. That's really too big, too much big of a cost for a reward. Like that, you, that's minus three plus one. That's not really great. When this card inflicts battle damage to your opponent, you can target one of your ba banish elemental hero monsters. Special okay, so if you could uh, get direct. If you could clear out your opponent's monsters and get direct damage, I could see how that'd be useful. Then we got Elemental Hero Lady Heat. During each uh, of your in phase, inflict 200 damage to your opponent for each elemental monster you control. So, yeah, this deck is not really packing punches. It's really not. Uh, I can tell off the bat, it's just not packing punches. This card gains 200 attack for each elemental hero monster you control. So you, you're really forced to... Um, you're really forced to have all of the elemental heroes in your deck for this. And then, this is my favorite card just because of the pun, Rottweiler. Huh. Ah. Ah. Fun day. When this card is destroyed by battle and sent to the graveyard, target one elemental hero card and one polymerization in your graveyard, add both of the targets into your hand. I really like this card just off of the design and off of the, the pun. I really like it, so that was cool. Then we have Elemental Hero Inferno, Elemental Hero Heat, plus Elemental Hero Lady Heat. Must be uh, fusion summoned, it cannot be summoned by other ways. If this card battles a water monster, this card gains a thousand attack during this damage step only. So that's actually good to fight, uh, I guess, to fight with a um, Maka Tsunami deck. But at the same time, Maku Tsunamis probably always have their... Uh, their field spell active so you're still gonna be losing 200 then we have heroes bond if there is a face up hero monster on the field special summon two level four or lower element to hero monsters from your hand uh h heated heart target one face up monster you control until the end of this turn against 500 attack and if it attacks a defense position monster <laughs> sorry inflict battle damage piercing damage i'm sorry that's a really good card. I can see how it'd be useful. Like you want to finish your opponent off sort of thing. I see it. 
Then we have fusion recovery. I, I could already tell it's just you get it from your graveyard, right? Target one polymerization and one fusion material that we're using the fusion in your graveyard and add them to your hand. So yeah, that's good for a Kaiba deck actually. Uh, gain 1,000 life points for each face of elemental hero monster you control. Uh, do you see that's very circumstantial. Hero barrier. During your opponent's turn, you can activate this card during the damage step. Any opponent's attack and uh, any any opponent's attack and that takes uh, place while you control an elemental hero monster is negated, but this effect only works once. Now this is probably my favorite trap card in this. When an opponent's monster declares an attack, your opponent chooses one random mon card from your hand. Then if it is a monster that can be special summon, special summon, otherwise it's a graveyard. And that's, at the, that's the end of these. I bought both of them as soon as they came out. Though I'm kind of regretting buying uh, that one because it was just... That one's not really great. Elemental heroes aren't that thrilling. And I'm going to be collabing with all of them today. So that's another update as well as another update coming at you. Computer gaming, PC gaming, I can't wait. It's coming soon to my channel. Hell yeah. So yeah, most southern voice available. And I'm at 11 minutes. I just want, for the ending of this video, I'm going to just show you guys how sad I am. Look at this. I, I, I'm, I'm not kidding. I'm summoning every card but blue eyes. Ultimate dragon. What is this? All right, I can't take it anymore. Ugh, look at all this. Look at those. I swear to God, if it's a gag and, you know, you can't pull all the cards and you, I have to reset the box before I can pull Blue Eyes off the Dragon, I will flip. I'm done. I will leave. Thank you, sir. Ah. So, with all that out of the way, I got like four URs left to summon, two SRs, 35. R's and 64 N's. I can already tell. Uh, no, I don't want to buy that. Um, I can already tell you're not supposed to be able to get all the cards. So let's just hope for the best. And we're going to do a multi summon. Let's go for it, man. I can hear Kala crying. Ugh. Or at least my crying. Ugh, damn it. Stop, stop, stop. Uh, uh. Yes! Oh, mother of God, yes! Jesus, this needed to happen. Okay, well, now this is pretty pointless. <laughs> ah, this is pretty pointless now. God. Um, I'm just stuck taking all of these cards. I have no choice, I'm stuck taking all these cards. Well, at least I don't have to summon from this banner anymore, that feels good. That part is great about it, I don't have to summon from the banner anymore. I'm done, Ooh, I got another one of those cards. Uh, SR? Yeah, we got the second magical hat! Damn. Well, this banner's done. I don't even have to summon from it anymore. Ah. Uh, I don't know what to say, I wasted 500 stones for that. When well, I probably could have just done a couple single summons. I was so tired of getting not what I want, so I just said, fuck it all. Let's see what we got left. One SR, three URs. Man, yeah, fuck these URs, I don't need them. I'm done with this banner, ain't, ain't ever coming back. Ain't ever. And let's see what we got in this Sorry, I just want to grab it real quick. Some warrior top monsters. Oh, I like how Yu Yu doesn't have a face yet. Hey, Wing Kribo! I might use that because it looks like an angel. And I am now allowed to use Jaden. New area open. Prepping, preparing to access. What? I haven't seen G much of you. I mean, why? Jaden. Okay, there's Jaden. Next generation. Ooh. 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 This is lit. This is hot, bro. This is nice. So Duel Links turns into GX. 
Studio GX era. Oh, oh, I wonder why they're pointing to Joey. Check out my A game. I wonder why they're pointing to Joey. Oh, that's so cool. You can change series. Want a duel? Let's get our game. Oh, on. this is cool. This is a this is awesome. So, does that mean I can add all the previous cards into Jaden or does that mean um or does that mean something else? So we're, we're just leaving Yu-Gi-Oh behind, linking with Jade and Yuki. Alright, yeah, this is hot, this is, this is nice! Wait, it's remodeling itself, it's gonna look like the futuristic, isn't it? Yo! Whoa, so this is Duel Link? Mind blown! What can be sweeter than the world duelists gathering at one spot? Curry, curry! Oh, that's a screamer, pal. Yeah, pal, I knew you'd agree. Oh, I get it. I was, I was wondering why he was saying curry, and then it's his wing free bow. Yeah. This man could talk to his spirit. So, yeah. I learned his that. If every single duel is here, maybe I can meet Yugi again. That'll be super sweet. I gotta get my game on. And I totally will. Will with my most awesome hero, Neo. Yeah. And with you too, of course. I can always tell you, Wing Kribo. I don't. I, Pokemon. I, I guess you go Pokemon voice for that. All right, let's get down to business. My hero already. To, my hero is already to throw down in a whole new world. Jaden Yuki unlocked. Jaden Yuki and Jaden's deck are now unlocked. Yo, this is so hot. I, I, I can't. I can't. This is too hot. Yo, this all is so cool. They they made it look so much, and there's new NPCs. I can't wait to learn all of this. Yo, okay. This is hype. Yo, okay, and then... To, to switch back to Yu-Gi-Oh era, I just click on my him and ready to throw down. I go back to my Yu-Gi-Oh. But it's, it's no funny. Hollow likes uh, Jaden a lot, so he'll probably stay in that area. Now I'm staying over here in Yu-Gi-Oh. But all that, all that. I mean, I can't use him over. I wonder if you can duel across. You you can duel across. Worlds, I bet. So yeah, okay, I really like this. I really like this. This is, this is neat. This is cool. I like it. So let me know what you guys think of this new thing in the comments below. This is really just what I wanted to do today. Just show you guys everything new with Duel Links. And they have Bingo, by the way. Cha cha cha. Bingo! Remember Vegeta's uh, speech? Cha Or not speech song. Bingo! Cha cha cha. Bingo! I don't remember how it goes. And they have this bingo thing where you can get massive amounts of rewards. And then bingo! What do I get? I mean, there's so much cool things to happen. Bingo! What do I get? Damn, I thought I just... BAM! Damn! Oh, I, I am scoring this again. Let's go accept those thingies, right? Mm. Was it just telling me I had 50 every time? Okay. Well, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Yo, I, I'm mind blown. Dueling, you know what? We had our differences in the past, and we're probably still going to have them in the future. But, yeah, my mind's blown. I, okay. So I guess I'll see you guys in the next video. Um, I'll probably work again today and post because Hollow wants to collab and I say why not to use my friend. So without further ado, like, comment, subscribe, maybe if you want, uh, watch my last video. And this has been Cyangel, signing out.